All right, we have breaking new developments tonight in the case of that Canton High School student who is in a dispute with his school. It's because he's growing his hair long for charity. News Channel 5's Deborah Lee is live in the newsroom. Deb, what's the latest? Today, that an agreement has been reached in the hair dispute. That was a, a report published in several media outlets. But Robin Ofterhide, the boy's mother, says that is just not true. Now, just to bring you up to date, 17 year old Zachary Ofterhide has been growing his hair long so he can donate it for wigs for kids with cancer. But the length violates the dress code at Canton South High School. And Zach had to serve an in school suspension this week. His mother told me the school district is offering to let him continue growing the hair as a community service project. But she says the contract they want him to sign is too vague and has too many loopholes, so they are not going to sign it. The, the way this one thing states, if Zach does one little thing and, you know, they can just turn around and say, well, I don't like the way your hair is laying today. This is all null and void, and you got to get your hair cut right now. Um, and we're not allowed to discuss this with anyone. Now, we reached out to the superintendent tonight, but so far she's not gotten back to us. We have received many comments on this story since it first aired from viewers who are in support of Zachary and what he's trying to do. One viewer even offered him tickets to the Rush concert this weekend in Cleveland. Zachary, however, who's a huge Rush fan, got his tickets over a month ago. On your side in the newsroom, Deborah Lee, News Channel 5.